Okay. <clears throat> so, um, welcome everybody to my second video. Um, I uh, first of all, I hope you're all healthy. I hope the the sound of the microphone is better. I just now ran some some tests and it all seemed to be fine to me. Um, so, yeah, let's uh, let's play some games. Um, and uh, uh, just like last time, I see some some names here that I know. Play for stacks, Matteo. So we'll see what uh, yeah, and what uh, where we'll get. Let's say like that. Okay, so I'm playing against Robert. Nineteen seventy-eight. Good luck. Uh, so yeah, he is already on the second move. Played uh, played a move that I've never seen before. Actually, that doesn't mean that it's bad. Normally, you build from uh, from square one. Um, I have. <laughs> Uh, last last week we had a, a training session of three days with the uh, yeah the the A team so to say and uh, it that was also uh, we trained on here on lead rods uh, so in those three days I learned how to indicate uh, moves and squares with arrows so square one is this one. Let's see if it works. Yeah. And uh, yeah, this this move nine fourteen. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing. Oh shit! How do I? Oh yeah, okay. This move nine fourteen, which he just did, is very. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to say it. It's not in the right direction. Let's uh, frame it. Down. Because he allows me to completely lock him here, and now this is just a basic one for three, and yeah, I should be winning here. I have one piece more now. It's gonna be another one. Um, but yeah, okay. Because of this move nine fourteen, there was actually nothing he could do should be able to remove these arrows somehow. Oh yeah, okay. I see that my opponent has left the game. Once when I was uh, playing from my phone, when someone had left the game, I could claim a victory somewhere, but it seems uh, like I can't now, which is fine. I mean. um, so yeah, this is going to be uh, over quite soon. Quick wins are always good. And uh, yeah, this, this seems like the perfect time for me to get some tea. So maybe we can replay a bit. Because it all went quite fast. This will save us time. So, I have my pieces nicely developed to the middle. I'm trying to, in the opening, I'm always trying to uh, build from squares 46 and 50. Oh, yes, now I can claim. Okay. 
Yes. So, in the opening, I'm always trying to build from uh, from 46 and 50. So here I've built uh, 30, 32, 28, so 37, 32, 41, 37, 46, 41. And then, because if you build from these two squares, your position will almost, almost always be nice and central. Um, I mean, I'm not calling this a mistake, but it's it's not good either. It's better to just uh, let's see anything else. Yeah, so the same here. Um, I mean, black has already got some some problems. These two squares occupied at the same time is usually not not a good thing. Um, but here it was still in the possibility to change back. Or, <laughs> or even play 10-14 and 5-10, which was a lot better than what he did in the game. Because, <laughs> oh, I can see this going wrong immediately. Because what he did in the game was almost losing by force. Yeah, there was nothing he could do here. This one's also not possible. So, he can only give away pieces, so. Yeah, and this was just two pieces. So, quick win, that's good. Um, let's go back. Since there are, I can see uh, 117 players online, I think we'll get another game fairly soon. Um... Let's see. Select for you. Okay, good luck. Select for you. Let's try this one. Okay, it's not, not doesn't have such a high rating. But uh, yeah, I don't know what that what that says rating. So let's try this opening. Uh, this is actually one of my favorite openings. I've had a lot of successes with this one. Um, even against quite quite strong opponents, I because uh, it's just so easy to generate some pressure with with white on the right side of the board. For some reason, it always uh, always works out. Uh, so yeah, that's nice. Black always has to watch out for this. Uh, okay. So my opponent is giving me a piece now. And I don't know exactly why that is. Okay, so he's trying to win it back. That's fair. I don't think he's going to manage though. Because after 914, which I think he will play, yes. Now I have this 2 for 2. And after 3 9, now I can defend it like this. Now after this one, I catch it. And after this one. <laughs> okay, so he does this. It was better to wait though with uh, attacking me since I when I'm defending such a piece there it's I'm always tied to that piece somehow so it's better to leave me hanging there a bit than to exchange it immediately okay so if I'm counting correctly I have one piece more now and now let's play for a trick okay it doesn't fall for it but a12 is quite a concession in that way, so it was useful. Um, yes, and now I think I might be able to just jump in here. This is not a threat immediately because he has this 
this two for two back. Uh, but yeah, now it's just winning. Uh, so I'm going in between two of his pieces and on the next move, yes, I have to watch out now because if I take this one, he takes two, but I can take this one first and now it's two pieces. Is it? Yeah, probably is. Yeah, now it's three. So this is, uh, yeah, smooth. Smooth so far. Yeah, it's uh, quite resignable. So let's play for another trick. It does not fall for it again. So I uh, even if he were to have three extra pieces somewhere, I think I would still be in good shape because I have just such a nice center and yeah, with uh, three pieces more, this is uh, this is it. So let's see if he's gonna give me everything or resign. Yeah, okay, he resigns. Okay, so good game so far. Let's see, Evano 38. Okay, good game, Ivano. Okay, so I'm again in my first game with Black. I'm going to play this personal favorite of mine. In the meantime, I'm having some immune support tea. Don't know if it actually works, but you can always try. In these times, it's important to keep your immune system ready for action. Okay, so this uh, happens quite often on the internet. Uh, but now I already have some, we're only a couple moves in and I already have some uh, advantage because this piece here is probably never going to get into the game safely. Uh, at least that's my plan. He can always try to develop it with this and then this. Uh, yes, okay. Uh, but that has other consequences. For example, that I can lock him with 11, 17, 17, 21. I'm a bit afraid of the arrows now, I'm noticing. But, um, Let's see, so I can play 14-19, I'm a bit afraid of 33-29 with a double threat, so I'm going to play 11-17 first. Okay, so he goes to the edge, which is reasonable, I think, at least when you were when you're not developed on this side and have this piece, it's reasonable to try and find some escape route. Um, okay, so I'm hoping for this one now. He sees it, of course. Because then I had a 1721, 26, 31, 23, 29. Uh, okay. So here I have a very nice central Oh. oh, oh, that's really bad. Oh, I'm ashamed. Oh, my goodness. Wow, how did I not see that? Oh, 
that's really bad. Okay, but you gotta play on. Somehow. I mean, there's a chance that I will catch this king. Actually. Yeah, that is not a good move. I feel. You should have kept that piece there. Because now I can just... Catch it like this, probably. Oh, I'm still embarrassed that I missed this. Oh, but yeah, now I'm just... I think I have a good position now, again. Wow. That's really bad. Okay. But you gotta play on. Okay, let's go. He's threatening this now. But I... Not afraid. Oh, I'm in shock. Yeah, okay. Oh. I just need to check my moves before I play them. Because this was typically a thing that happens to you only if you're not, like, uh, you're not paying attention. I mean, it shouldn't happen. And if you know that there's a combination, you will, you will see it within the snap of a finger. But Uh, okay, so let's see. I'm back in the game, I believe. And now uh, I'm thinking, I'm wondering where I should put this piece, there or there? So, yeah, actually I actually have no idea. Uh, because this has its benefits, but also it's not so nice, so yeah, I don't know. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, I'll put it here. I just have to do something. Okay, so that one seems strange to me. Okay, so he's playing quite passively. That's good. I'm hoping to get control over this square somehow. But I'm not sure. I will. So maybe he's going to change. Yeah, he's going to change. Um, let's see, I can play 1722. Yeah, I don't know. Just gonna follow my intuition here. So this one, yes. This one maybe. Catch it. He's gonna change. So now I can grab twenty-seven, which seems nice. He's playing quite fast, that's unnerving. Okay, so let's see. Yes. So, maybe I'm not even going to win this, actually. If he plays this one now, I have to make a very difficult move. Uh, he doesn't. Oh, this is a good idea, I think. Oh. That's... So I have to change. Yeah, now maybe I'm fine again.
use that. That's one for two. That's nice. So oh, I thought he was going to give me. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So now it's easily winning. Uh, I just have to figure out a way. So this seems just good. Uh, this, 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 he has to go to five, yeah, this should be over, but you never know with me. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's difficult playing quickly with without a mouse. But what can you do? Okay, so now it's just over. Now it's easily winning. So I have three kings. Yeah, there's uh, nothing you can do. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh. Why? It just said I had n no problem at all. <sighs> Fuck. Okay, so in this position I can easily win with this move. Yeah, okay. Not going my way so far. Okay, so mark again. Okay, so this time I really need to... <laughs> I don't know what's wrong. It hasn't... The internet hasn't dropped all day. And now suddenly when I start to play... It feels like it's... Uh, it has its... Uh, it's done its job or for some reason. Yeah, that's just unfortunate. Okay. But I hope it's, it's not... Uh, uh, yeah, what was I going to say? I hope my play is still in some way instructive. Okay, so let's do this. Don't know if it's good, but... Actually, it's, it seems quite bad. But yeah, I was my, the only trick was uh, this one. So now I'm having. Uh, so if he takes back, I have this one for three, with one piece more in the end. So he takes this one, and now. Yeah, I just have a. A nice position, nice and central. He has some weakness here on the edge. And this is, uh, I believe last time there was also a player that did this. That changed towards the center and with no central support at all. Uh, so I think I should be able to, or I can just play this and this and exchange it towards the middle. Um, yeah, that seems the most logical, actually. I mean, I can try to surround it, but he also still has no weaknesses, so... Don't know if it's... if it was gonna work. Okay, so let's see, I just have to... Uh, build my position nicely. That mean 
means uh, that I want to build some formations that can uh, let's see so Uh, the most logical thing to do would be to play this. So now I have a threat, this one. And yeah, I don't actually know what I'm gonna do when he closes it, but yeah, it just seems seemed like the most logical move. Uh, now there is the possibility for some some attack here so he will play this to strengthen his position and then I can attack um, yeah that seems fair Okay, so let's follow the plan. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's very sensible. So he tries to exchange it immediately to and tries to make it. If I close this one now, for example, then he tries to make the game, yeah, kind of classical. So I have to uh, yeah to try to not let that happen too easily. But yeah, he's playing quite well, so I don't think I don't know if it's gonna work out. Okay, so this one is interesting. Uh, yeah, I think this is a good move now. I can take this, of course. Then I take, yeah, take here. And then go there. And... Uh, I don't know if he's going to be... He's gonna be able to keep it classical, so to say. Um, yeah, maybe he is. So what do I do? What do I do? <laughs> I have no idea. It's just I'm just worse here probably. I mean I can change, but I don't want to change. So I'm just going to play something that's probably not good for me, but I want to win this game, so you have to improvise. Okay, so let's see what he's going to do here. Yeah, so that one now. I'm coming back somehow, I think. Maybe not at all. I feel like you should not have allowed me on that square. Yeah, this is very... It's like a thorn in, in Black's position right now. 
So this. I believe after this one there's no tricks. So I'm just winning a piece there. Uh. Yeah, okay. And now I was thinking this and this. Uh, takes and this and oh that's clever that is clever okay oh well that's not necessary you can just play on I think I mean I'm not saying it's a draw uh, but maybe it is you don't know Maybe it, it probably it is a draw actually. Uh, let's see. Takes, takes, 21, 27, 18, 12. He goes here. I, 37, 32. He goes there. I go 12, 7. And. Yeah, I don't see. White would be easily winning. So probably it's not. Okay, very good game, Mark. I had nothing there. Okay. So six points. 42nd place. And the first has, wow, 28. So I should uh, hurry up there. I think. Okay, you never know. If I just play fast enough so that the internet will reset before I run out of time, then uh, I should be fine. Okay, so against Mama King, good game. I don't know what it is with me today. Just not not playing, playing so good. Okay, you have those days. I mean, also when I'm recording this, I secretly hope to, uh, like, instructively crush every person I play against. Um, but yeah, that's just not happening today. Apparently. Okay, so back to the game. My opponent has played quite okay so far. He's done no weird things whatsoever. Uh... So let's see, I cannot play this one now, which seems like a logical move. So I have to, yeah, I don't know, just do something like this. Yeah, okay, it's changing. And his position seems quite out of balance now. Feels, feels like that. Don't know if I'm going to be able to do anything with that information, but yeah, he has to change this some sometime. Yeah, okay, now and I mean maybe he's just fine, but it feels like I should have some some possibilities here. Um, okay, so let's start with this one. Because this, this four is a, uh, yeah, in Dutch it's called blokje van kokkie, 
I don't know how that's called in English, but it's uh, it's just to indicate that these four are generally not very. Uh, they don't make your position more. Uh, yeah, how do I say it? I don't know. But yeah, you get what I mean. If these four are here and not supported by any formations here and there, it's just generally not so great. Okay, so this is an interesting choice. Whether I should go to 25 or 24. Because I have the feeling that if I go to 24, I will have some problems with connecting these pieces. But yeah, the same problem will be there when I when I start with 20, when I take towards 25. So, um, mm, yeah, I think this is better. Uh, actually, there's not much of a difference, but Yeah, this feels just really nice. So now there's these, if he cannot never attack me here because I always go to 30 and make, make a king. And otherwise there's completely nothing he can do to strengthen this wing. So he's just waiting there and Let's see, this seems very good. It's not nice, but... Or this is even better, I think. Is it though? Yeah, this looks nice. Now I actually already have the threat of, of playing this. He has to take two and then this. Um, so yeah, I thought about 3126, but I think I still have it. And then piece on 25 is unstoppable. <laughs> so yeah, this is a waste of tempo, I think. It should have immediately try to create an attack here of his own but maybe it's not so clear because I uh, yeah so this one seems fair because the, if he plays this one now I might have some trouble uh, with making a king on the next move yeah so he tries to defend that um, yeah it's quite quite tricky still but okay I mean he's not going to be able to keep it in the position forever so let's go here. So on the next move, I already have some ideas of 1823 and then making a king, which seems to be, oh, I have to watch out. Okay, just play this one first. Yeah, this is not clear at all. Why did I? Okay. <sighs> okay, so now I have this idea. 
I think. That saves the day. So you can go 39.34. I take 27.21. Uh, and then I attack on 22. So I hope my internet is still there. Because for some reason it always happens on the most crucial moments. But I have the feeling that my opponent is still thinking. Yeah, this seems winning. Yes. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, this is just over. Almost bungled that one. Oof. Okay, so yeah, in the middle game, it's really these four that are entangling his position. So here, yeah, I think it's better to wait just one move to try to break open the position with. How do I? Oh, yeah, okay. Try to break open the position with this 2 for 2, which is probably not so good, but... Uh, yeah, after this one, it's just... When I get control over 24 and his uh, wing is weakened like this... Uh, yeah, I think it's just already already quite bad. And this was a nice trick, of course. And let's not talk about the way I I won that game. Oh, okay, so I think my tea is done by now. <laughs> oh my god. My tea bag just fell in. Okay, I should make a first move quickly. It really is that kind of a day. Okay, once again, I think I played against Alto Bailey last time, or maybe not. Uh, I played against him once, yeah. As you can see below. I think I lost that one on time. Um, so yeah, i trying to control, oh, he's playing very fast, uh, but already, I think this was also a theme in the last time I recorded something, that my opponent already has played his piece on three, which is not particularly uh, good in this case, okay, so he tries to be to play this interesting system. But I think his pieces are not developed enough to have a chance here. I feel like. I mean, of course, I should try to keep it that way somehow. So let's see. Uh, this seems reasonable. Let's try to build some formations. Now, yeah, I think this is, is fair. He will, oh, he will not. I thought he was going to exchange this one towards the center. Uh, that was more, more logical in my opinion. Okay, so I hope I can play this. Uh, I didn't really count the number of attackers he has. I think it's enough to 
get me out of there actually. Yeah, but now it's I should be fine. Uh, okay, so let's do this. Check, check, check. Yeah, it's possible. And because he does not have uh, a piece on two anymore, it's not possible for him to easily get me out of, of 24 here. So I think I should be... Mm, I think I'm already quite happy here. So let's see, he's trying to exchange my center, which I don't want to... I don't want to let that happen, of course. So I'm just going to change back towards the center. And... Yeah, positionally I should be I should be winning here because uh, yeah he just has a lot of weak pieces and there's not not really a plan connected to any of his moves it's just hoping that the yeah how, how do I call it a bit of damage control uh, while my pieces are nicely into the center I still can build some formations and yeah. Okay, so he's trying to exchange towards the center one last time. Uh, but I really feel as if it's one last time. Sure, I should watch out for some, some tricks here. I think I can play this. Uh, can I? Yeah. Now he's probably going to exchange. Then I exchange back towards this square. And he... Okay, so he doesn't. So yeah, now I should really watch out for some tricks. I think this is fine. Uh, oh. This is quite tough. Um. Yeah, I shouldn't think too much. Just play. It will probably be all right. Uh, yeah, will it though? Okay, maybe this? It seems off. But yeah, there's really not, not much other moves. Wow. What a strategy of my opponent. Okay, so this is nothing. I was trying to avoid that one. Uh, which I did, luckily. But he thought he had it, so... That's, that's nice. Okay, so... It should, this is hopefully... Ending soon, I think this seems like a winning move, yeah. Yeah, I think this is over. He can attack me one more time and I defend it and he can start giving away pieces, which he does. Uh, so yeah, that one. Uh, yeah, I can. I, let's just play this. I don't want to be rude or anything. Yeah. 
so now we can indeed okay good game auto bailey um, I mean I thought your strategy didn't make sense but for some reason I had st still had some troubles in connecting my pieces with each other so that's uh, yeah unfortunately you, there was this blunder of 1721 so here I mean the the, the position is not good, but yeah, it's not in any way lost, I think. You can just play on it. Maybe you'll get a draw, maybe something like 1822. Okay. But if I want to make it towards the top, I really do have to hurry. Wow, who's this guy? Vera Chechina. Wow, 36, that's a lot. And I'm at, uh, wow, 12, okay. So we're coming. Let's see. So I don't know how to pronounce this. Is this Domnet or Damned? But yeah, in any way, good luck. Uh, so let's see. Oh, I got a challenge. Um, yeah, this one seems fair. I've never studied this or anything, so. Um, I should not let him get into the attack too easily. So I think, yeah, maybe 1722 is sensible. Uh, yeah, I want to try this one. It's too much fun. So let's see. So this is interesting. Oh, thirty one, twenty seven. That seems strange. Um, yeah, it's more logical to just play this and use these formations to exchange towards the center. Uh, but now, yeah, I mean, so this is probably going to, oh, now he does this. Yeah, that does not seem right at all. Uh, but okay. So what's... I think this is logical. Maybe. Yeah, that one... Uh, so this one seems fair, I think. Um, so yeah, in general, this is this should be should be way too risky. Uh, so let's play this. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. 
if I play If I play 1721, is there anything you can do? Also, if I play 410, is there anything you can do? The answer in both cases is probably no. <sighs> but it's just too difficult for me. Ah, he wants 410, this. Yeah, that's quite good. Okay, I'm just going to play this one. It's actually riskier for me than I thought, yeah. Um, so let's see. Can I play this? And then 914? Maybe I can. Maybe it's going to go completely wrong. It's also possible. Wow, what's that? This shouldn't be anything, I think. Yeah, OK. <laughs> Just has no idea. Um, or maybe I don't. Wow, what am I doing? This is not good. Uh, yeah, that one. <sighs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, I think I can play this. Yes, okay. Now let's make some threats. Mm -hmm. Yes, okay. Whew. this seems easy but might be not so easy so I think the best for him now he has to play that one so I will try to defend it like this and I'll just try to play quickly not to lose on time Yeah, this has really been a strange game. So I thought for some reason that is... Uh, uh, his position did, it ma did not make any sense, and then suddenly it made sense, and then it did not. And then in time trouble I was convinced that suddenly it did make sense. No, it doesn't anymore. Oh, yeah, time travel really is, uh, is dangerous. Okay, let's quickly go back. Okay, calm, stay calm. For some reason, I did not really trust my feeling there. Uh, okay, so Ben de Ben de Cido. Uh, yeah, twenty twenty five. It's been one of my favorite moves for a long time. Uh, Okay, so my opponent has played quite passively already, it seems. Um, oh, wow. 
Yeah, this again is very passive. Um, but let's see. Okay, so I think this one makes sense. And this. Yes. Okay, so now he's threatening this. So I'll play this one to try to uh, yeah, get these pieces out of the game. Can I? So let's see. Okay. So when I'm here on 23, it's usually not the right thing to play uh, 1 and 5. Because now there's no way for him to exchange this piece towards the center. So that's just a general general rule. Of course here he can try to play it more actively. Uh, but yeah, in general you want to keep those pieces when you try to play against an attack like this. So I'm just trying to uh, develop my pieces nicely. Uh, let's see. This one seems good. And I just have a, yeah, a very beautiful position here. Um, I don't know exactly what he what he should do here. Uh, I'm just trying to to uh, to press his pieces towards the edge and take profit there in the center. Um, so let's see, he has played 9-13, uh, which is fair, obviously. Uh, I think it's nice to get this one in the middle as well. Yeah. At least it looks nice. Yeah, so now this one should go here. And now I have these two pieces attacking, supported by my center. Uh, now I think I will yeah, try and attack him once here, just to get one of his center pieces away and improve my piece on 47. Yeah, okay, now this might be the right time to exchange here. Might be. Yeah, it looks nice. Then my attack really is... Yeah. Because now if I get to control both wings... That should be, positionally speaking, very good. Yeah, but then again, I'm not, not sure about this. Uh, let's see. So the most logical thing to do is this one. Yeah, which this seems good. Yeah, and now I'm quite happy because now uh, he did. He already didn't have pieces one and five to exchange my piece towards the center, but now he has also given up 
the PSON2. So there's absolutely no way that he will uh, create any sort of counterplay against my attack here. So I'm thinking about 1117. Then I might I uh, will probably play something else, but I might be able to uh, does it work? No. Oh, it doesn't so it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, this is logical I think. Just uh Try to build some formations on the right side. I think I want to aim for this type of cross formation. After which, my position is just full of pieces that work together, and his position is just uh, a mess, hopefully. So, yeah, now he does this one. But I was thinking I could maybe win a piece here. So if I attack once. Yeah, let's try. He changes. I play this. It seems dangerous, but I think it works. And if you think it works, you should do it. It's more of a general uh, tip I want to give everyone. Always trust your own, yeah, okay. Always trust your own calculations. Even though they might not be right, there's nothing else you can trust. Uh, so I'm thinking how to finish this cleanly. I think this one should do the trick. Uh, yeah, I don't know if it makes any difference here. So let's go here. It's probably resignable here. Yeah, after this one, it sure is. Uh, so, well, let's see. Here. And then to 22. Yeah. Okay. Interesting game. I think my first. Uh, Actually, hmm, clean positional win. Uh, so it's, it started here somewhere when I got this nice attack in the center. And yeah, here I won a piece and, uh, and then the game with this small combination. So good game. We're back in ninth place already. I see the first has uh, Vera Cecina has decided to oh has lost the game so has, has lost the streak also there's someone in second place actress that has uh, 36 but he's on pause right now so uh, and we're on 20 with the flame, so we might be able to... Ooh, MF. Uh, so let's try this. 
Martin van der Sluis. Okay. Good game, Martin. Uh, yeah, that one. So this is an opening that I, uh, I think, played a couple of times, two, two or so. Uh, one against Ron Heusens, and the other one I can't remember. But that game against Ron Heusens was very interesting. And I almost, almost. Uh, managed to win against him at uh, at the age of I think yeah what was it it was 2000 and, uh, 2012 or something so I think I was 14 there to great frustration of Ron himself <laughs> of course Um, yeah, so I don't know what exactly I've done here. Don't know if I <clears throat> have got anything uh, so let's see what is what's the most logical here? It's an idea to go uh, here uh, to develop peace. 40 towards 30 to try and be aggressive here. Um, yeah, but I'll just uh, play a waiting move first. Hmm, that's actually really bad. Because now, yeah, if he plays 10 14, I have some problems. I wanted to change here, but he attacks me, and then after this one, he has 1823, and if I catch it, he wins with 1621. So, I need to find something else. So, let's go with this one. Another waiting move. If you don't know what to do, just wait. And, okay, so yeah, he, he heard me, apparently. Um, so let's see. Yeah, now if I play 40-35, he's 40-19, which is very irritating. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to change back. Since he has some issues in developing this wing, it might be he might be doing okay here. I mean, I think the best for him is to, yeah to play eight thirteen two eight. Um, yeah, it might be just worse here. But okay, you gotta continue. Oh, that one. That might be might be a good move. Hmm. Hmm. Oof. Yeah. I don't know what to do. Oh, okay, so just going to change here, which is not good, but. So if he plays 1621 now, I think I'm... Okay, he doesn't. That's good. 
Now I might have some possibilities. Because his his left wing is also not 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 so strong. Uh, yeah, of course I missed this move. So yeah, this. Can I play this? I think so. Yeah, so he should just attack me on 21, then exchange 18-22. And he's doing very well, I think. Or... Yeah, so for some reason he's playing every move I'm suggesting, so... Maybe I should stop suggesting him moves then. <laughs> oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay, so let's try this one. Oh, okay, focus, focus. Uh, Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, so he just has a nice center. And I'm just worse, probably. Yeah, I'm going to attack this. He's going to take his two for two. And I'm hoping this isn't too bad. I'm also hoping he's going to get into time, time trouble somewhere here. Um, yeah, this. Just want him to make some decisions. Yeah, okay, that one, very fair. Yeah, so this is just nothing. Okay, so he doesn't try to win. He could have easily beaten me from that position, actually. I had absolutely nothing there. Uh, yeah, let's see, I don't know, maybe this, this, um, oh, wow, I need to be fast. Oh, what a terrible move. <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, yeah. My hands are sweaty. It's not going the right way. Okay, so let's exchange this. Apparently, <laughs> oh man, <laughs> yeah, see, that was the plan, he was going to get into time trouble, and then, uh, yeah, so this is easily winning. Wow, what a terrible game. So, what I want to say is if you're watching this, please don't do what I do. 
Uh, yeah. Just after this move, 10 14. I mean. I should probably exchange towards 24 here, but. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, I missed the. This move 14 19 at this moment, I, I just missed, so. Yeah, not good, not good. And then here, I mean, yeah, my. Maybe I should just leave it like this and bring this piece here and these pieces there and there and try to break through here without touching this. But I mean, I don't know. This was not good. He should, yeah, I think I should just try to play 11 17 and 8 13, 12 18, 7 12. Try to build something strong and then just beat me because I have no wing here. It's just nothing. Yeah, this was. Yeah, just a draw. And then, in time pressure, under time pressure, you completely panicked here with the 1823. Where I think even 1621 is still a draw. So let's go. It's not good, but it's. Productive, so to say. Um. Okay, against Hansi, seventy-six. Good luck, Hansi. So I must be able to. After this nice win in the in in this attacking game, I must be able to just play decent draughts once again. So let's try. No nonsense, just... I mean... Yeah, so this is... I hate to say it, but this is quite boring. Uh, also, I don't know what to do. Uh, if I should go from four or from two. And also, I don't know how to remove these arrows. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. So, uh, let's just wait one more move before deciding. So he attacks me, I catch it. And now I think, for some reason, I have the feeling that I want to go from uh, from two, because he is quite uh, kind of weak in his wing here. I have the feeling that I might be able to to get something there if I. Uh, what's that exactly? Oh, that's funny. Yeah. So after this, he has this, and that, and that. Towards ten, but okay. I'm just going to, or am I? Hmm. Okay, yeah. I should just make a move. Yeah. So I was. I thought he was going to play that one. Ah. <sighs> That's irritating. Oh, 
of yeah it always has this exchange now because I cannot play this one so I will I was not even going to take it wow yeah that's logical I wouldn't take it either Ah, okay, let's hope he doesn't take it once again. Yeah, okay, now I actually might have some... some play on the left side of the board. Left side for me. So I should try to... Uh, not let him become too active. Yeah, this one seems logical to create some space there. Yes. And I'm hoping that in this in this classical game, when he controls these center squares, it's always nice to have uh, control over both wings. Now, this is not generally very strong, but it does control this side of the board somehow, and the same is for same goes for for this. And yeah, in general, you have good chances in in a classical game when you control both sides of the board. Uh, so let's see, this one seems logical, does it? Uh, yeah, I don't know, this one seems fair. Yes. Ah, you can attack me. Oh, that's, that's very bad. Yeah, somehow I completely overlooked that one. Oh, I should have just played 1823 instantly. Oh my goodness. Yeah, what do I do? Yeah, three nine is irresponsible, I think. So. Yeah, not that. <laughs> not that this is this is uh, always threatening. Wow, this is just nothing. I mean, not that this is less irresponsible. In any way. Uh, let's try this. Obviously hoping for 39-34. Oh, which he plays. So unless he has something brilliant now, I think I'm winning. Uh, yeah, this one. So this is a piece. I have a feeling that he might play on, yeah. Which is reasonable because he has a lot of compensation for the piece. Oh, now he's threatening. He's threatening this. Yeah, now I think I can play this one. I think so. Oh, wow. Uh, this, maybe? Okay, let's go for the end game. Yeah, so this is obviously winning. 
since he has no square. Yeah. Oh, did I just... Is it winning? Oh, yeah, it's winning. Oh, this is close. <laughs> okay, so probably he's trying to make a move and he doesn't notice that he has to take. Yeah. See, yeah, this is winning. Yeah, so I give it back. Go to painting. Go to one. And run this one to king. Yeah. Wow. Very bad game again. Maybe I'm being too hard on myself, but. Yeah, it's just not good. I feel like I'm very lucky today. I should be able to just play one half decent game. Very fr <laughs> frustrated. <laughs> oh. Maybe I should get another... Another team. Just not this immune system crap. Just something that boosts your your draught capabilities. Okay, so I'm playing against Heikneuter, which I believe is quite a good player. Yeah, uh, as you can see from his rating. So this is a line that I've played a couple of times. Uh, I don't know a lot about it, but I think uh, what is the idea? I think somehow fourteen twenty was the idea here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I remember. Um, so yeah, I, the last time that I had this on the board was against... Uh, I think against Richard Moser in the, the National Club competition. And then, so it was a very exciting game, because he, he locked me on 27, I locked him on 24, and then we had this interesting position where neither of us could really move. Uh, and somehow it worked, out, it worked out better for me, and I won that game. But it was very interesting. So here... Uh, yeah, it's probably going to be a similar, similar type of structure where he will try to lock these pieces into place and I will do the same here. So let's start with this one. Uh, is that good? Yeah, that's okay. Um, yeah, let's now play, I don't know, maybe I should strengthen my, my center first, so this, and probably it will go 37, 32, 38, also possible. I will just try to strengthen my center. So that means probably that I will include this one as well. Yeah, that one feels risky to me because now when he plays this one, he has this weak square. 
I mean, I don't want to say it feels risky, but I think it's better not to play that one. Uh. <sighs> okay, so let's see. I'll just uh, hope that I don't know anything. Yeah. So maybe this one is an idea now. Or maybe it's nonsense. Oh, I don't know. I just have to make a move, I think. Let's try this. That seems fair. Yeah, let's now try this. Let's now try this. Okay, so he's trying to exchange towards the center. Which is very sensible, but I think it might be, yeah, I'm very unsure about this move that I'm about to play, but it just seems so funny. All the other moves spoil something, which I, I don't want. So... <laughs> Yeah, this is probably not, not a good move because of this. But my, my plan is that if I... If he plays this one, I'm quite ideally placed, I hope. Okay. Okay, I think that's that's good. Uh, so what's his plan after after that one? He's going to close, I think. Let's see. Or can he close? No, he cannot close. So he has to catch it. Uh, oh, this is not possible. I think. Yeah. Well, I was blind there for a second. <laughs> and just before the new T arrives, I win a good game. So let's try out this new T that I bought. It's called Sen Sencha Green Tea. And it says it's from the exclusive collection. So I'm always very attracted to things that are from the exclusive collection. Okay, so let's go. So there's still one hour and 19 minutes left. Yeah, uh, what? One hour and eight minutes left, uh, nine. So I was kind of looking at the game there on the right. Um, I don't know if I'm going to play all the way to the end. But I do want to see how far I can come with it. I mean, the game I just played was, was quite okay, so if I can somehow reverse the trend of playing very poorly, 
then I'm already happy. Otherwise I can't go to sleep safely. So let's see. He plays 11-17, which allows me to... Uh, to play 28-23 to... After which his piece on 6 will be gone, and the piece on 1 is also gone. So he won't have access to the Olympic formation for the rest of the game. Um, so yeah, just to prove an instructive point, I'm going to play this one and try to make it work. Because this, uh, this is quite an important formation in this one in a classical game like this. Oh, okay. Uh, so let's see. This one seems fair. This one. Mm, this is logical, I think. I want to make it as close as possible so that he so that his, his lack of the Olympic formation will kind of stand out. Yeah, okay. For some reason I missed that. Maybe he's already fine. But okay, gotta continue. Uh, yeah, this allows me to play this interesting move, 28-22. I'm not sure if it's good, but it is interesting. Uh, so let's see, 28-22, be, probably will go 24-29. Take stakes, 39-33, if it's possible. I mean, I can also just do nothing, but... Might be dangerous, might be dangerous. So... Yeah, once again, I don't know what to do. So, uh... Yeah, I'll go with this one. You can close, yeah, that's good. Uh, let's see. Two, two, one, one. Take, 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 yeah. So now he can do the same to me, but it's not equal, I think. Because he has some problems in developing his position. Yeah, like this. Now I don't know exactly, but this might already be quite a problem for him. Uh, if I can find a way within the time that I have left. Uh, poof. Okay, let's try this one. Oh, that's very bad, I think. Let's try this. Yeah, so I have to try something like that, but this can't work. Maybe this sacrifice seems seems funny. Yeah, this one. It will go twelve eighteen. Yeah, I think I think it will go. 
that one. That's not possible. No, I should have gone 1218 there. It was not over yet, actually. Or maybe it was, just didn't see. Uh, yes, okay. Yeah, now it is over, I think. Wow. Okay, gotta start pre moving. Oof. Okay, so playing without a mouse is quite scary when you have no time. Because this mouse pad, I also have quite a quite a cheap laptop. Or yeah, at least it's it's not made. The mouse pad is not made to to make the difference on this on this thing. Uh, but yeah, I just don't have a mouse yet here. So I'll try to fix that, and hopefully, I won't have as much panic when I have no time. Because normally when I have one second left, there's no panic in me at all. But when I take three th three seconds to make a move with this thing, then it's another story, of course. So, about the game, that was quite, quite good. In the end, it was very clear that he missed his... See, very clear that he missed his Olympic formation. So that's good. Um, yeah, and about this one. Don't know yet what this is going to be. He'll probably take this attack. And he's open, opened very aggressively. Uh, so now my plan is again to hope or to play it such that these pieces won't come to life. Which, uh, yeah, I seem to be getting a good shot at that plan because my wing here is quite, quite clean. I mean, I have no pieces here, here, here. While all these pieces, they're not really like, they're not really attacking much. Um, So I think I should be should be doing well. But on the other hand, there's nothing decided yet whatsoever. So let's see. Uh, yeah. So an idea is to go twenty nine, twenty three. To also misplace these pieces. That, that seems. Yeah, actually, it seems quite nice. I think. Uh, does it? So 23, 29 takes, takes. Probably 13, 19 because I have a threat. Then 35, 30. 2025. Yeah, you know what? Let's just do it. It's too much fun. Mm. Yeah, so I think he will play something like 1319 here. Because I don't really see another way to get this thread out without removing uh, a central piece in your position, like piece on two. You really don't want to put it there. <laughs> yeah, okay. So the plan was 35.
Yeah. So I think it's it's okay to Yeah, I'm not very I have to admit that I'm not very familiar in this type of, of game. So I don't exactly know what this is what this is about. I can take this combination still. It seems quite nice, but also quite drawish. So I'm gonna go with this. Hoping that he has some issues in uh in getting his pieces active. Which maybe doesn't at all. Yeah, so that's sensible. He tries to activate four. Um, so let's see what to do. There's the interesting idea of playing 37-32 to have this combination on the next move. But I don't know what if he will play 15-20. So let's just wait one more move. Um, yeah, I'm secretly hoping that somehow my position will, uh, yeah, this, now I can play this, I think, or I can still play 1420, yep. Oh, I have some tricks there. Oh, place two seven. Yeah, I feel like that's not not the right move. But then again, what do I do? Ah, uh, messing this up. I'm messing this up. So I'm hoping someday he will run out of, of moves somehow. Okay, so he's starting to get scared, which is good. Maybe this. Uh, this. Yeah, now it's uh, it's good again. I think you should play eleven sixteen. Oh uh, yeah, that one I don't know. Why is this not a piece? Ah, is yes, some sacrifice. Twelve eighteen thirteen nineteen. No, he doesn't. What's this? He's trying to give everything away. Oh, I thought he was going to give everything away and play on my time. Which would have worked, maybe. But okay. Yeah, so this was a very interesting game. I think I misplayed it somewhere here. But somehow for him it wasn't easy to... Yeah, here of course he should play 3-9. And then 10 14. And I think it's just, just winning for him. Uh, is it? 
Yeah, probably it is. Yeah, because there's nothing I can do. So just this, this. Then I have these two moves. And then he has 913 and finish. So yeah, very good game by Superman. <laughs> okay, so somehow I got in first place with, I think, the most terrible display of draughts I've ever witnessed of myself uh, since, yeah, I don't know since when. Okay, so... Michel Stemfer, again. Uh, last week I also got uh, got to play against Michel Stemfer. So, good game. Okay, so this is interesting. So, again, my plan will be to lock these pieces out of the game. This is quite a, a line that is often played on the internet. Uh, I think the move that I just played isn't so isn't so so common since he I started to think um, but yeah generally this this type of position is just very interesting so let's see he has to go to 20 now, I think. Yeah. Um, which is already not a thing he would want to do, I guess. I mean, it doesn't look nice. Uh, yeah, but what can I do? Let's see. Um, okay, so let's go with this. And this. Yes. Uh, let's go with this one. Is that good? I don't know. Yeah, I should, I should play something at least. So he has this center, these center pieces, but they're not, not so strong and supported by formations and on top of that he also has this piece on 15 which I very much uh, like to play against and usually this combination is not not recommended uh, because they're they're like yeah they're just not 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 good in the same position because normally when you have a piece here, you want to go either there or there. Uh, but yeah, the, these two are not good together and these two also give rise to some combinations and threats. So. But then again, this is very... It's not very specific, of course. Here it's, it's just fine, I think. Um, okay, so let's see what he's going to come up with. 
Yeah, so we place that one, uh, which feels a little ugly. But I think these pieces will join the game somehow. So let's go with this one. I don't know why exactly. That was not, not such a great move. Um, yeah, maybe his idea is to go here. Which actually seems like a good idea. So it might be best to just exchange this one already. Uh, 48, yes. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think it's best to just wait one more move. And he's probably going to exchange this. And then try to come with 10. So now his position seems nice because he has some control over the center. But I think somehow it doesn't quite work. Uh, yes, but I don't know what to do. So maybe this. It seems like an interesting move to challenge his center. Uh, yeah, this. Because now I just want to take the center of my own, and this seems like a, yeah, just like a blocky van Kocky in the other position, but now here it seems very silly somehow. Um, yeah, he has no formations whatsoever. If there were pieces here and here, he could support these pieces by some, at least some resources, but I think here it's... Yeah, it just seems quite silly. Um, yeah, but maybe I didn't play it uh, too accurately enough. Uh, yeah, I don't know. This one? Yeah. Playing so bad. So he's probably, it's best to play uh, 50, 44, and then attack me on 28. Oh, or just win. Oh my god, just 29, 24. Missed that completely. Oh wow. Jesus. Uh, what's this? He's trying to win now. Yeah, sensible. I mean, no, I don't have any advantage at all. Maybe I can try to swindle somewhere, but I don't think so. Oh, that one. Yeah, it's just a draw. Oh, 
terrible. Yeah. I mean, I can say all I want about misplaced pieces and uh, stuff. Uh, but, yeah. It's hard to believe me if I just don't convert any of these positions cleanly. Oh my goodness. So bad. What was I even thinking here? Yeah. Yeah, maybe I should just change to 21. No, but it seems so logical to change towards 22. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I just don't understand. Takes, takes. I should play 1319 somewhere here. Yeah, it seems very counterintuitive. That's probably not good. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know why that didn't work. Uh. Okay. Oh, that's very nice. To everybody watching, I can highly recommend the Sencha exclusive collection. Okay, Dom Kombinatie. Good luck, Dom Kombinatie. So let's just try. Uh, uh, yeah, wait also one more. So he's giving me uh, a nice, easy, central game so far. Um, so yeah, let's see what he's going to do with, with this wing now. Seems to be a, a theme in every game almost. Where my opponents have this, this wing that is undeveloped and they try to make it work somehow. But here I have my doubts. But yeah. Uh, so I don't know what to do. So let's just play a move here. That one. Um, yeah, that's possible. I think I'm going to play this. Okay, so I removed my own attack, but I hope that now it's easier for me to uh, play against these pieces. So let's see. So, I'm thinking about 1117, seems quite nice. 
Oh no, what type of move is this? Oof. You could just maybe exchange all pieces and then... Yeah, this was the thing I was aiming for. This seems really nice. Thirty three twenty nine. Uh, it seems like I have this move now, which is quite nice. Yeah, now this. And I hope that these pieces are all misplaced and in the meantime I'm working on an attack of my own here. Yeah, probably it's easier said than done. So I want to play 3-9 uh, now, but I think I might have some problems with this this uh, route, for example, if he plays 47, 42. So I'll play this one first. Yeah, it will go there. Now I can close, I think. And on the next move, I play 21, 27. Or not yet, I can just wait. And my feeling says that these pieces should be out of the game for, yeah, for what, for the rest of the game. Okay. So let's see. Oh uh, yeah, now I can play eleven sixteen to play with this threat. But it seems more logical just to go twenty one twenty seven. Can I? I think so. Yeah, so he goes to the edge. Um Yeah, maybe 11.16 is good. 11.16, 31.26, 2.8. Uh, he does have 43.38 there. That is really irritating. Wow, I should just... It really doesn't matter what I do here, I think. Why can't I just... Okay, let's, uh, I don't know, let's try something. Well, I mean, it doesn't matter what I do here, but it, it shouldn't. Like, it should be winning either way. So... I was not happy about my last move, the 1319, because it did allow him to activate some pieces there, and I promised to not let that happen. But he's still not out of the woods yet. Yes, okay. Yeah, I thought I could play this. But maybe I'm wrong. Let's see, you can take this king with 36, 31. Takes 47, 41. Takes that 38, 32. I take towards 20. 
takes the king, then I play 21, 27, takes knight 13, and I win. So that's not possible. Uh, but yeah, on the next move, I can. You can also play 24 20. That seems like the most reasonable thing to do. Yeah. Which he does, of course. Oh man, let's try this. Okay, so the good thing is he also has no time. Um, yeah, I don't, I just, I don't know, uh, this, he'll play 29, 23, oh no, he won't, yeah, this is, uh, very bad technique, I would say, but, in the end, it seems to be just good enough. Just good enough. Not more. Yeah, so he has no way to catch me. Uh, it still doesn't. This is funny. Yeah, it takes. It takes. It takes. Yeah, it's over. Well, I mean, that went well originally, but then. I mean, here I should be just almost winning, I think. Maybe this was not so smart. I should have kept it there and played for this this threat and force him to take some action first with piece 47 before. Yeah, because here there was the, the problem that I mentioned uh, 1116, 3126, this, and then I want to change, but he plays 30, uh, 4338. I have no moves except for 2832, which is absolutely not the thing I wanted to do. So, ah, against COVID, 73. COVID-73 in English. Uh, 1940. Not so high. Also not so low. Yeah, this is a move now. Fortunately, he does not do it. Uh... Yeah, this is this will probably also result in some kind of attack versus surrounding kind of battle, which is always interesting because now my opponent in the last game had these pieces that did not really join the game ever, and now I have them of my own. Uh, so yeah, I'm trying to make it work. Now already I've developed one, which is nice. Uh. Okay, so let's see. This is very interesting. Um. So should I just play the attack or 
should I somehow play the Rosenberg uh, attack? I think it should be the latter. So, but I don't know if I should play. If to that end, I should play forty-eight or or uh, forty-seven. Yeah, forty-eight makes a lot of sense. Now he'll probably play. Oh, that one I did not expect. I also don't know if it's good. What if I play this now? So I have this threat now. Takes, 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 33, 28, and I win some pieces. So he attacks me, now I defend. Uh, and he can never remove this piece with... Oh yes, of course, he tries this. Okay, so he tries to... Play this, but now I think I have a nice... Nice center, and I can always exchange this piece to support my center. This is not really an attack. Well, I hope that in the future this is going to be a strong attack. So let's try this. Yeah. Uh, this one seems logical. Now I, let's see, I can try to attack this piece here. It seems good, but it, now that he, yeah, this seems, this seems, uh, this must be good. Can I though? He has some interesting possibilities maybe. I think it's possible. I think it's possible. Because for example, if one of these two pieces was gone, he would have a nice combination towards 45. But now that they're there, he does not. Okay, so what should I do? Should I attack once again? Can I? Can I attack once again? Yeah, no, I should just play for the center now. Just easy. And since it's, he has no good formations, because this one, I can go again to 24 and it will be gone. So I think he's trying to postpone that exchange for a moment. That it's, it's good enough, but I don't think... At least I hope that moment will not, not come. Um, yeah, but now... This is interesting. Should I allow him to exchange or not? Actually, I don't know. Maybe I should. Yeah, I think I should. It's always a shame to 
Oh, it's trying to be tricky. Okay. Uh, can I be tricky back? Maybe. Oh, he played that one. Uh, this? I should hurry. So now I just, I'll play this one. And then on the next move, if he lets me. Okay, he doesn't. So I'll change back. That move doesn't make sense to me. Yeah, now I have a lot of control. I think it's over already. I attack him. And I think I can play, yeah, this one and take the two for two with a free run to king. Okay, so he's trying to be messy, but doesn't work. Yeah. Okay, good game. Quite a good game. Just very uh, technical. I think he should have. He should have played this one here. My plan was to go here and there. And then he goes there, I attack him, he has to take, I take two. Uh, but yeah, that, that didn't seem clear to me after 22, 27. Maybe it's good, but... But okay, good game. I'm just secretly hoping that I will get uh, to play Vera Cecina. At least once. I think now that it's only 20 minutes to go, I should... Uh, I should just finish it. I mean, I'm not doing well, but I'm getting a lot of points somehow. Okay, once again, Dom Combinatie. So, good game. Let's try this. Okay, so he plays this interesting line which is one of my favorites with white. So let's try this. This is very theoretical, uh, but it's difficult for, for black, I believe. If, if you don't know what you're doing, it's difficult for black. At least that's what I thought. But then I played against uh, this guy, Landry Nga, in the World Championships of this year. And he did something. Uh, just played the, the main variant like this, yeah. And then here he played 1-6. I think. Then I exchange 34, 29 takes, takes. And the theory says that white has a very good position there because if black, black is, is tied down and if black exchanges uh, 20, 25, then 37, 31. But this guy just played 17, 22 and had no problem at all. Um, but this, however, loses a piece. Unless Dom Combinatie has also thought up something. But I believe that this is... Uh, yeah, okay, he didn't. 
Yeah, this is now just losing a piece. And the game, hopefully. Uh, so let's play there. Let's just first develop these ones. Hmm, one six seems off to me. I mean, this formation is not very useful at this point, so it's better to just play. Yeah, so one six is, is not good. I mean, of course, he's already a piece down and losing probably, but uh, so what's the most? What's the most smart thing to do? Maybe this one. Yeah, seems like a good move. I want to attack him and then exchange and run to king. Which I think... I don't think he can do anything against it, honestly. So let's see. Yeah, that is. At least, it looks like desperation. Uh, so let's play this one first. Now he. I don't think this is. I mean, if I were to move, I don't think I would take this, but I would just play this. Yeah, this is... Uh, okay. So I he takes, I play this, he takes, and I take four pieces. <laughs> four. Yeah, okay. You get what I mean. Um, so, good game. Just an opening... Uh, not to play as quickly as he did when you don't know the theory. I would say. So let's see, it's 15 minutes to go. I'm still hoping for Vera Cecina. Can I actually see who that is? against Dwayde. So good luck Dwayde. Let's go again with 1923. Okay, so he does this. So far it's the same game as against, uh, I believe, Heikneuter. Yeah, still the same. Okay, so he does go there. Yeah, this was my game in the World Championship against uh, Leopold. Yeah, I don't really know how to pronounce his, his last name. Something like Kowogue. We always just say Kugu. Uh, but in that game, yeah, it's an African player. So you probably have to pronounce it in a French way. Like Kogogui, something like this. But in that game, uh, it was in the in the elimination round of the World Championship, and I, um, I got a slightly better position out of the opening, and then managed to press him towards a defeat. But it really was. Uh, Uh, let's see. So, yeah, my opponent should probably play that one sometime. Which he does now. 
And yeah, I think he's fine here. He should be fine. But let's change. Yeah, I have the feeling that I didn't really play this uh, correctly. But then again, it's kind of the story of this evening. So I can play this now, which seems seems good, because now he has given himself this hole on 38. So after 20, 32, 28, I can just attack him on 19 a couple of times and exchange this piece. And Hope that I have chances to break through on that wing. And now, uh, yeah, what now? Maybe he just, yeah, I think he's just fine, but I'll try to exchange this one. Mm, 43. Um, yeah, my position is, is not good here. Uh, I also have no idea how I'm going to fix it. Maybe just lost actually. But okay. Wow. What do I do here? I don't know. Because if I attack, he has this two for two, and I probably lose this piece. And yeah, there's really not much else to do. Maybe this or something. Feel like I'm just just losing here. Okay, I have to try something. Um. Take, take, take. Yeah. It's just it's just very bad. Try this. Then, yeah, okay. I have this defensive resource that saves the day, but so if he plays this, yeah, now I can play this. I take two and hope that my control in the center is of some. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, I should try to play actively. Maybe this. I can go there. I'm trying to play against his, his weak wing here. Which is not actually quite, yeah, it's not actually weak, but I have to claim something here. Yeah, so I think I have to play this exactly. And then, yeah, what do I have here? Don't think I have a lot, to be honest. I mean, there's the possibility that he will make mistakes. It's the only thing I'm hoping for. 
yeah, no, that's that's a good example. Yeah, I had this thread. Uh, ah, okay. Which he fortunately didn't see. Wow. Okay, so can I just please play Vera Cicina once? Has been on the top all the time now. Maybe it seems like he's not online, so maybe he has left the tournament. He or she shouldn't assume gender here. Vera does sound female. Yeah. yeah, it seems like um, it's impossible to get by me anymore. Let's see, Bastian, who's this? Hmm. Unclear. Okay, let's go with the aggressive approach. See how that works out. I mean, can't go any worse than it has gone today. So, yeah, this is a very famous line. I have played this with white a couple of times, and almost never with black in, a in an official game. Uh, but I like it more for black. So, yeah, that doesn't make sense at all. Okay, so let's see. Um, yeah, what do my opponents always do here that I find irritating? Cannot really recall it somehow. Maybe it's 8.13? Don't think so. Yeah, uh, I should just uh, put my pieces on, on central squares and hope that it's going to be all right. Yeah, so that's a good move. Uh, What do I do here? <sighs> I mean, this? Mm -hmm. And maybe this it's probably going to exchange this one that seems like a good move oh it doesn't so now I think I can play this Also, I'm now just seeing that this is probably going to be the last game. So I should try to finish it in style. 40-35. Wow. These are some moves that I, I would never think of. Uh, let's see. So this... Seems quite okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
So, an interesting... Oh no, wait. I want to say an interesting idea is 1621, but... You can just play 3328 then. Uh, so what do I do? Again, I have no clue. Maybe this? Seems very shaky. But maybe I can get away with it. So I think this is a good move now. Then I will probably have to change back. Yeah, also 38-32 is maybe reasonable. Unless, yeah, I don't know about that one. It would be reasonable if I wouldn't be wouldn't have the possibility to go into the attack once again. Yeah, I'm very curious what he will do here. So he does do this, okay. Yeah, this is a very serious threat, so I have to have to play this. And now it does seem like I'm back in the game somehow. Or am I? Oof. Okay, so now this, I have to think if I want to allow this. Uh, probably the answer is no. So, let's play. Yeah, this one seems funny. Because I was thinking that he could play 44, 40? Because uh, if 2024, then he has 2822. But then I have 1923. So yeah, this is. Uh, I don't know if that was necessary, but this is just nice. Uh, I don't know actually if it's if it's very nice. So let's exchange one pair of pieces first, then go to the center. And then hope that this attack will be decisive. Uh, let's see, this one seems logical. And this. Yeah, so he does go to 38. So he has no resources on that side anymore. So that's good. That one. Okay, so let's play this. And now six. Yeah, now this one. I should have nice winning chances here. This one, you can exchange. Uh, that seems the most logical thing to do. Yeah, this is. At least I hope this is not good. But I don't know exactly. So this one maybe. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's just exchange. Oh, it's not good. Not good at all. Wow. <laughs> I mean, 
How did I even... I have to fight for a draw here, probably. Jesus. Yeah, let's go for this. Oh, the technique. The technique. I mean, I'm expecting it will still be a draw. Uh, yeah, this one. Yeah, he changes. And then I go to two and I change. Oh, man. Feels bad. Oh, I have to play on. Okay. Yeah, just bad. No, wow. Yeah, this should be winning. It's just a very nice attack with no no counterplay for white whatsoever. Yeah, this. Ah, oh, I see. Oh. Just embarrassing. Just an embarrassing performance. But somehow... <laughs> yeah, somehow I did win. So, uh, yeah. I, I actually don't know what to say. Just uh, an extremely bad day. Again, I've been trying to study all day. Uh, played the piano, studied some topology. Uh, so yeah, I'm kind of uh, kind of done now, and it uh, somehow it showed in my in my play. But okay, you can't always uh, have your day. Somehow I was hoping that a day like this with absolutely zero level uh, would come only after the like the first five streams or so um, yeah this was just embarrassing but okay I did win um, unfortunately did not get to play via Chichina I was on top the whole tournament um, but yeah I hope uh, it was still instructive in some way uh, and yeah uh, yeah I don't know what to say I'm I thought I was reversing the trend halfway and then uh, yeah this game against Michel Stem for, for example just bad technique or this last game just missed a simple combination so not good, not good, but uh, okay, a win is a win, and a tournament win is uh, in the books, and uh, yeah, I thank you for watching, and uh, hopefully I'll uh, I'll see you on my on my next video. Um, more importantly. Stay safe. I hope the sound is good this time. I haven't checked, but um, stay safe, stay healthy, stay inside. Um, and yeah, play droughts. That's all you can ask. Okay. Bye. Thank you.